a very good morning to all uh, i would like to start the lecture series uh, video lecture series uh, due to coronavirus uh, we are unable to take the regular classes so i am planning to uh, share a video lecture on our regular topic uh, which is assemblers so in due course system programming we have discussed softwares are two types application softwares and system softwares so actually our main objective of the course is to learn in detail about the system softwares Uh, system softwares were what are the system softwares we have discussed in our regular class compilers loaders linkers assemblers so we have in in our regular class uh, we have completed uh, compilers in detail so what is a compiler compiler is converting source program into target program so there are various phases are there we have discussed in detail all those phases like lexical phase syntax phase semantic phase object oriented code intermediate code and code optimization so these uh, llr parsing llr slr parsing which we have completed in our regular course and in our last class we have also started assemblers so assemblers uh, design specifications or conditions are identify the of course this lecture we have discussed some of the part and some of the part we have not discussed so uh, in, in this video lecture i am starting from assemblers so some of the design uh, specifications identify the information necessary to perform a task so we have to identify the information which is perform to a task and design a suitable data structures to record the information so here we have to perform the task first then to perform uh, to perform the task we require uh, to store some information for that we require data structures so we have to design suitable data structures to store the information and uh, third um, design aspect is determine the processing necessary to obtain and maintain the information so here we have to determine the processing Uh, necessary to obtain and maintain the information and the fourth design aspect is determine the processing necessary to perform the task so these are the four main design aspects while you are designing a assembler so now let us discuss uh, one by one so broadly these four uh, design uh, aspects are divided into two phases so one of the first phase is synthesis synthesis phase and analysis phase so in the synthesis phase let us consider uh, uh, instruction move r b register 1 so address of the memory word with which name 1 is associated so uh, depends on the source program so it uh, it must be made available by the analysis phase so here that we are considering an instruction by instruction assembly language code and uh, there are two phases are there synthesis phase and uh, analysis phase so in the synthesis phase address of the memory word with which name one is associated so machine of code corresponding to the mnemonic move r 